Sharika Jackson, the world's fastest over 200 meters. Elaine Thompson era, fastest human over 100 meters. Lifetime best of 1054 seconds. Shelly and Fraser Price, five time undisputed world champion. Lifetime best of 1060 seconds. But who is Julian Alfred? And why should anybody be worried about her? We will answer that question later in the video. The indomitable Jamaicans has been dominating the 100, 200 and 4x100 meters for the past 2 to 8 years, winning multiple world championships and Olympic medals between them. Over the years, there have been many rivals they have faced, both individually and as a team. Now let's turn our attention to the elephant in the room, Julian Alfred. Julian Alfred, born June 10, 2001, is a St. Lucian sprinter. She won the silver medal in the 100 meters at the 2022 Commonwealth Games and gold in the event at the 2022 NCAA Division I T and F Championships. Alfred was the first woman in the NCAA to break the 7 second barrier over the 60 meters. She attended St. Catherine High School in Jamaica from 2015 to 2018. She then pursued a bachelor's degree in Youth and Culture Studies at the University of Texas. In 2022, Alfred had the all-time best NCAA performance in the 60 meters at the NCAA Division I Indoor Championship, running a fast time of 7.04 seconds in the heat. And at the age of 21, she became one of the top 30 fastest women ever with a time of 10.81 seconds in the preliminaries at the Big 12 Conference Championship in Lutburg, Texas. This was also a St. Lucia National Championship record. It also marked her as the fastest woman ever from the organization of Eastern Caribbean State. At the time, only six Caribbean women had ever run faster. On the 25th of February 2023, Alfred broke for the fourth time existing collegiate record and became the first woman in NCAA to ever break 7 seconds over 60 meters with a time of 6.97 seconds at the Big 12 Indoor Championship in Newburgh. Her time moved her up to 8 on the world all-time list. She also achieved the second fastest all-time collegiate mark in the 200 meters behind Oldley Abisteiner. Now let's answer the question about should anyone be worried about Julian Alfred? Well, maybe they should be concerned because she's improving with every month that passed. She is just 21 years old and have already run 1081 in the 100 as a personal best. Some people are saying that 60 meters and 100 meters are different event. My answer is this. What if she can get her start together by using the 60 meters and then execute that over the 100 meters because we all know she has a good top end speed in the 100 meters already then she may simply be unstoppable julian alfred is to be taken serious in fact every world sprinter that runs the 100 should have an eye on her the young lady is simply amazing sharika jackson elaine thompson and shelly and fraser price are all stars but respect must be given to new prospect athletes like julian and tina clayton who is another emerging prodigy. My closing argument is this. Julian Alfred has the ability to excel both in the 100 and the 200 meters with the right coaching and mentor. She definitely will be a force to be reckoned with in a few years.